may be found in the possession of a man with insane mind. He said he found baby in a garbage heap in Spanish town. Welcome to our J Crazy News headlines on a special Wednesday afternoon to those who are watching this news broadcast. Now to my viewers and my subscribers. You know, Jamaica is really and truly a sad place. And I say this with no apology. Yeah man, Jamaica is really and truly a sad place and it's getting worse every day now this precious baby boy was found in a garbage heap by a man of unsound mind in spanish town and then handed over to individuals now people are saying that they don't believe that this man who is of unsound mind, you see his kid right now, found the baby. Some person said he took the baby because in the video, which I'm going to play that part, they were saying that they saw fresh marks on his body, which could indicate that he and somebody had a fight or they were wrestling. And he took the baby from them. We just don't know. It could be that he, quote unquote, allegedly attacked a woman, a tassel ensued, and he took the baby away from her. We just don't know. But if he indeed found the baby in a rubbish heap, then by all indications, the parent or the parents need to be found by the police and also held responsible. Could be a single mother. She don't want the baby anymore and put the baby in the rubbish sheep. Now, there is no excuse whatsoever for a woman with a young Old, to place a child in a rubbish heap in bushes along the roadway wherever and leave the child there this is what you call child neglect and this is a serious crime maybe not in Jamaica but in other countries like America, Canada, England other European countries, you name it. And in those countries, if found, the parent or parents could be placed behind bars for a very long time. Even 35 years. I'm telling you, child neglect in places like America is a serious crime. As a matter of fact, it's close to committing murder because when you as a mother or parents neglect your child and place them in bushes etc anything can happen to them even killed and eaten by stray dogs and wild animals etc etc so it is pretty much close to murder now if the words of this man who is of unsound mind is true do you know how many women in Jamaica with a young or old cannot give birth because of womb complications Ovaries not working right, 
etc. And they would want a child. Listen, they are adoption centers in Jamaica. Adoption agencies. Stay care. Where if a young lady don't want her child, she can make a phone call, get in contact with authorities, and you can place the child on adoption. It's simple and pretty easy. Do not throw away your child in bushes and rubbish sheep. I call that careless and neglect. A child is a precious being. Many women can have a child, as I said before. And for a woman to have a child and throw away her child because she don't want a pitney is like spitting in God's face. Don't do it. It is wrong in the sight of the Most High. If you don't want your pitney, call the adoption center. And on the other hand, if this man who them claim to say is of unsound mind took away the child or stole the baby, then the government of Jamaica need to do something seriously. You can have persons like these on the streets. Yes, man, you never know. It is the PMP or the JLP responsibility to actually place persons who are mentally ill in institutions. In Jamaica, there is no rehab centers. Why is there not any rehab centers in Jamaica? In America, you have rehab centers. In Canada, you have rehab centers. England, you name it. All the money that the government have stolen over the years, why there's no rehab centers or rehab homes across the 14 parishes of Jamaica? I call that carelessness of the government. As a matter of fact, there should not be any unsound men, men or women on the streets in Jamaica. They should be all placed in rehab centers. Now it was the parish of Westmoreland where on Monday evening at exactly 6 p.m. Sylvine Woodbine aka Breda or Scat, a cab driver was shot and killed by criminal elements on a motorcycle in Keyville, Westmoreland. Reports are that around 6 p.m. Monday evening Woodbine was traveling in his motor vehicle along the Keyville Main Road where men on motorcycle stopped him or signaled him to stop. So Woodbine stopped. The men asked for a tool that they could use to fix something on their motorcycle. Now Woodbine came out and was looking for the tool when one of the men put a handgun to his head and fired one single bullet killing him on the spot. The gunman escaped successfully. The police was caught to the scene and arrival they saw Woodbine lying in a pool of blood. It was indeed that he received a single bullet wound to his head. Now so far there is no motive as to why he was killed. The police are investigating. Still in the parish of Westmoreland where this morning a 17 year old was fatally stabbed by a robber during a robbery after he resisted. Now dead is 17 year old Anthony James of Dexter Street in Savlamar. Now based on information this morning around 12 10 a.m. on Louis Street Anthony James 
was along the roadway when a robber came to him with a knife and tried to accost his motorcycle. Now, Jade refused. After refusing, the robber pulled a knife where he stabbed James multiple times of the body before escaping. The police was summoned and James taken to the Salomar Hospital where he died while undergoing treatment. The police are investigating. Now we head towards West Kingston to be exact, Jones Avenue, where last night Adrian aka Talman, who you see on your screen right now, was shot and killed in an area which is called Penn Street at the premises. He was shot multiple times by the hands of criminal elements. Now so far, there is no motive as to why he was killed. The police are investigating. This is Jay Crazy. Again, until then, have a blessed and safe Wednesday afternoon. Yeah man, I'm here to see a black legend. I'm here to represent for Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. So watch, like, comment, subscribe and share out the thing. Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. In review news and entertainment. Celebrity lifestyle movements are free. Jay Crazy not playing in my review the thing then. Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. In review news and entertainment. Celebrity lifestyle movements are free. Jay Crazy not playing in my review the thing then. We do the thing then, we do the thing then Jay Crazy Reviewing news, entertainment and celebrity lifestyle We do the thing then, we do the thing then